uh, the Sports and Social Bar. It's a bar in Parliament. It's very popular with researchers. It's uh, one of the bars that anyone who has a pass to Parliament can go into. Uh, Thursday night, uh, as you know, Parliament wasn't sitting today, which means that for a lot of the researchers, their MPs have gone back to their constituencies. It's a nice opportunity for them to let their hair down and socialise with other researchers. It was karaoke night. Um, it was a very happy occasion. Everyone was having a lot of fun. Uh, and then Eric Joyce appeared on the scene. I'm told there was an altercation outside the bar that I didn't see. What, what I saw was Eric Joyce coming into the sports and social bar. Um, he looked very aggressive. Um, he then tried to get served at the bar, went back outside. Um, I followed him outside and by the time I got out there he was wrestling on the floor with uh, two police officers. I'm told that officers tried to move him on from the scene, uh, tried to get him to leave the parliamentary estate uh, and he rounded on them. Um, there was. Um, a, a really quite undignified scuffle uh, which was being witnessed by about 40 or 50 parliamentary staff. Um, the bar staff were trying to keep people back, the police were trying to keep people back. Uh, I then saw Mr uh, Joyce be handcuffed uh, and taken away by a, a, a what can only be described as a posse of officers. Uh, and then about 15 minutes later um, I was passing the members entrance to the House of Commons which is where MPs go in to go into the House of Commons. Mr Joyce was uh, on a bench, he's being restrained, still 50 minutes later, he was being restrained by three or four officers and then uh, as I was observing that scene, a police van arrived and those officers bundled him into the back and he was taken away. I mean, I thought it was really unfortunate, particularly because this particular bar is for researchers, they're not paid £65,000 that MPs are, they're, they're normally very young and they're, you know, they're not paid a lot of money. Um, I was actually genuinely shocked, I was shocked at the level of violence that I saw against police officers. People like me that work in Parliament every day, we see the police every day, there's armed police standing outside Parliament. You know, we're used to them providing the protection in the building that we work in. So I, I was genuinely shocked to see a member of Parliament assaulting police officers. Um, and I also think it's sad that, uh, you know, the only other fight I've ever seen in that bar was also an MP. So I'm concerned that the, the researchers, the people that work hard in Parliament all week, and, and all the staff there, the people that do the catering and provide the security, uh, that their bar is getting a bad name for the actions uh, of a Member of Parliament.